The Fire on Ice Hanukkah celebration is back at West Hartford's Blueback Square. It's happening this weekend. And joining us to talk all about it is Rabbi Shia Gopin of Shabbat Hartford. Now, you're one of the organizers of this event, and it's really grown because this is now the 10th year. That's right. It's been 10 years, and every year it grows, and we're very, very excited about it. Yes. And what's going to be new and bigger, of course, this year? You know, one of the themes of Hanukkah, you always add another light, another candle. You always got to grow. So uh, right. this year we're going to... Uh, um, in addition to all the uh, excitement, we're going to be adding a live performance by the Rogers Park uh, Band out of Chicago. And we have this great, great energy there. It's become a, a really uh, iconic event in West Hartford um, at Blueback Square. And every year more and more people come. And uh, we want to take that energy to a higher level. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of fun activities. Great for families, That's open right. to everyone. Families, activities for all ages. There's music. There's going to be a live olive oil press and 3D dreidel making. and. Um, you know, one of the highlights are the ice menorah. We call it fire and ice because uh, we have a live ice sculpture. Right. It's, it's eight feet tall. Eight feet right? tall. And he sculpts Very it. It's impressive. Beautiful. Yeah. And then when you actually light the menorah, put the fire on, it's on really, the really ice. special. And, uh, and that's really uh, the highlight point. And you also have a special uh, passing of the torch ceremony yeah. happening, that's right. right? That's right. Leading up to the menorah lighting, we highlight different members of the community um, who really shine their personal light. And uh, we're going to highlight different stories of different people, and each one's going to light a different torch, which will lead up to the menorah lighting. Mm -hmm. And just a couple things to mention, the Gelt drop-off is going to be at the West Hartford Fire the, Department. The fire department's coming, and they extend their ladder. And uh, it's very exciting when the fireman goes all the way up, and then he's sprinkling coins, chocolate coins. We call that Gelt. Gelt is money in Yiddish, but they, now in Hanukkah we have chocolate coins for children. And it's going to be raining coins and people are able to go and collect. And that's very, very exciting. So not only with, with the guilt, but there's also another uh, thing that you're going to give everyone, right? Well, everyone... You brought one of them with us, with you here. That's right. One of the things we want is for people to take the traditions home with them and light the candles in their home. So if anybody needs, you know, Hanukkah menorah candles, we have those kits. We're going to be distributing it on Sunday at the event. And anytime during Hanukkah, you know, tonight's the fourth night. Tomorrow night, 5th, Sunday, 6th, and they can always come and contact any of our Chabad centers throughout the state to get a free Hanukkah menorah kit. All right, and just yeah. recapping, it is happening on Sunday afternoon. It starts at 4 o'clock in the afternoon, right? 4 p.m. About how long is it going to go? It's probably going to go from 4 to 6, 6.30. Mm -hmm. And yeah. this is really one of the biggest Hanukkah events in the state. Yeah, yeah. It's really grown over the last 10 That's years. That's right. We're expecting nearly 1,000 people, if not more. Um, it's going to be a lot of exciting for all, a lot of excitement for kids, for, for, for kids, adults, people for all ages. Please come and join and, and join in the excitement. Absolutely good stuff. Thanks so much for being with us. We are going to have that information on our website and on our Fox 61 News app for folks to go and recap and get all the info that they need. That's right. Thank you so much.